Well, hello, my gems. Welcome back to my channel. This is Glissy Gem. How's everybody doing today? Hope all are well. Thank you for clicking on my video. Um, subscribe. Also, follow me on my social medias down below. I have my platforms down below, Twitter and Instagram. Also, give my video a thumbs up because it helps out my channel. So, in this video, we're going to go ahead and do a Glam Glow. Um, I got this in one of my BoxyCharm boxes. Um, my December's BoxyCharm. I got this in, in there. It is the Glam Glow, the Hollywood California Glam Glow Glow Lace Radiance Boosting Hydration Sheet Mask. I'm not a sheet mask type of a girl, but for my for my skincare junkies <laughs> who are into skincare, may love to see how this, this performs. And who knows, y'all may like it. So we'll see. Let me try it out. The instructions say apply bottom half first onto clean dry face, smooth outward from center of face to line. And then apply top half and repeat, leave on for 10 to 15 minutes. It says remove mask and gent gently massage in any re remaining liquid. Use once a week or as desired. Okay. Sounds simple enough. All right. So what I'm going to go ahead and do is I'm going to go ahead and do my skincare routine first. And then I'll wait so all that can soak in, my moisturizer, you know, my serums, all that would sink into my skin and let it look like the way it is now just let it look dry and clean like this you know there's no kind of glow to my skin yet or anything like that so um once my skin gets becomes dry you know then i'll go ahead and apply this right so just give me a, a second and i'll be right back Okay, I'm back. Uh, this is just me finishing up with my skin routine. I just wanted to let you know. Um, I already applied all my routine products except for my sunblock because I'm going to put that after I put my mask on. I already put moisturizer on. And I was thinking, well, it's a hydrating mask. Um, should I have done that? But you know what? I've doubled, doubled on. I doubled down on moisturizers before. So we'll see how it, how it goes with me applying my moisturizer. Um... And I did put my serum on, like my, my superfood serum, and I did put my vitamin C serum on as well. So I'm going to let all that soak in first. And then once my, my face looks like it's settled in, like everything has settled into my skin, then we'll come back to the masks. And so then the last thing of my routine would be just putting on the sunblock after the mask, of course, after it's, after it's sunk into my skin as well. I'll put on the sunblock and then I'll do my lip treatment for my lips. Right, so I'll see you here in a little in a little bit. All right, my gems, I'm back. So we're gonna go ahead and apply the mask now that you see that my everything sunk into my skin. My skin looks a lot drier now. Excuse me, one second. Okay, I'm back. I'm sorry, I had to take care of some business. My I don't know if you heard my dog barking in the back, in the background. Um, he heard something that startled him. But anyway, so back with this, we're going to go ahead and apply, like it says. Um, I just want to read the last step where it says, use once a week or as desired. But before that, it says remove mask and gently massage it, remaining liquid. Okay, so simple. It's, there's nothing to it. Simple. And then I will be doing a check-in with you guys to see how um, how the mask, if I had a reaction towards the mask after putting it on. Because, you know. I'm work. I'm working on a documentation or a video where I am. Oh, this is hard to come off. Where I am, um, I'm testing out this uh, clay mask, and I, I had like allergic reactions. You know, like pimples, break it, breakout pimples. My pimp I've been breaking out in pimples. So, but that's for another video, which will, I'll be uploading soon once I've tried the product out as as much as I can. Um, Give me one second. Let me get some scissors. Okay, finally, I got it open. So on with my mask here. I'm not a mask type of person, like I already mentioned, so I'm not going to repeat myself. But I'll just do it for the sake of my skincare junkies. So here we go. This is how the inside looks like. Ooh, it does look kind of lacy. So let's open this up. Or let's take pull this out. And see, I, I feel like I'm pull, I was pulling out a pair of underwear. <laughs> That's what it looked like to me, like a pair of underwear. 
like lacy underwear. Okay, so, ooh, you heard that? It, it, it has that serum on, so, okay. I don't know, I guess, uh, I guess it's okay. It's all right to have that type of a effect, you know. Now, how do I put this on though? Like, how do I put this on? I don't know. It's so weird. Like, it's stuck, or do I need to tear it, or what do I need to do? Look, where is this supposed to go? Really, like, my bottom, my jaw. But how is that? Okay, let me, let me, let me, let me check the other one out. There's two of them in here. Oh, here, this is the one for the eyes. I see. This is the one for the eyes, so, or is it for the mouth? Ugh. Let me find out. Let me find out. Sorry. Uh, my video cut off there. Okay, so I'm going to open this one up. And, uh, okay, this looks like the top part. Oh, it is the top. I need to put the bottom part first, it says. It says, um, apply bottom first. Ooh, you know, you guys, these, this smells really good. I love the way it smells. It's, it has a small, has a small, has a mild scent, pleasant scent to this. So, how am I supposed to put this on the bottom part of my, uh, There's no, I guess I, should I tear it? Should I just, I think I need to tear this. I'm going to tear it so that I can put it on my chin. Like, maybe like this. Around the nose. Oh, it's supposed to go around the nose. Around the mouth. Okay, it smells good. It has a very lightly fragrance. It's very, uh, it's very lightly fragranced. It smells good. I I could uh, I guess I can uh, describe the scent as a clean floral scent, but it's not. It's more like a clean scent. I want to say like clean scent, not too much of a floral or sweet scent to it. Um, It just smells clean, like a nice clean serum. That's what it smells like to me. So it's nice, it smells nice. And it's made out of that gauze tissue type of mask, if y'all can see that. And it has these really nice detailed silver detailings on them. So how am I supposed to apply this there's a section for the nose. I might have torn that part off. And there's one for the mouth. I don't understand this. Okay, I don't understand this. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna do my best. Oh, I guess I see this little cut right here. I guess this is for the, to go around the nose. Hold on. Oh, and I still need, oh, I was supposed to open it up. Uh, I tore it. It was, it was just folded. See, these are so hard to, to work, to even figure out. Because I tore it, thinking that I was supposed to tear it. But anyways, we'll, we'll work with it. Ugh. Now I need to figure out which side is for my chin and which side is for my nose. So, I'm telling you, I'm not a mask person. <laughs> I am not a mask person. So... Am I supposed to 
apply this. Okay, so I'm just how I guess this goes on my chin. I don't know. Maybe it goes like this. It's really nice. I like it. I'm going to do 15 minutes. While we're waiting for those 15 minutes, I guess I can tell you how I feel about this mask with the it comes on it's it was kind of complicated at first I didn't really know where to where to put what because it was folded so because it was folded it tore on I, I I felt like I had to tear you know like one of those perforated I thought they were like perforations and I just tore to kind of fit your your face I don't think I'm supposed to be talking while I have this mask on because it feels like it doesn't come off Yep, it's like once I come off, but see, so uh, that's where I went wrong. I tore it and I wasn't supposed to, but lesson learned. I like it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna see how it does. It feels good. <clears throat> it looks good. Let's see, do you want to see sexy Stephanie? <laughs> I want to see my sexy side with my lace mask. So I'm going to take a brush. So I'm going to take a brush. 
toothbrush. Brush my hair. Well, I'm waiting on this mask the 15 minutes. It feels really the serum the serum is really gentle, smells good. It doesn't have a really strong scent to it. Um it's it's, it's like the it's like a serum. It's like a serum. It's not, it's not a cream. It's more of a serum type of mm. Sorry, that's from our tour. I'm going to have a hard time trying to uh, work with that. But anyways. being a mask person this mask looks really nice I would really this mask is really nice I think I can do these types of masks I think I can use these types of masks and not feel ugly and <laughs> not feel like horrible not look horrible not feel but look horrible Yeah, this is the se sexiest mask I've ever worn. I'll be back in 15 minutes. off um I think my mistake was this bottom part where I tore it off and I wasn't supposed to well lesson learned right <laughs> so now I know next time if I do get to shop the add-ons or um, the pop-ups try it again we'll see how what kind of um you know how this does to my skin so i'm gonna, I'm gonna take off the remainder of of this um i'm gonna take the, the i'm gonna smooth out the remainder of this serum on my skin and i'll be back to do a check-in with you guys to show you how my skin looks before applying makeup, of course, I'm not going to apply makeup until I um, for sure show you and give you an update on how this, it feels really nice. Oh, really nice. I definitely wouldn't, wouldn't mind buying this on the add-ons or pop-up store. I'm not a, like I said, I'm not a mask type of person, but a mask like this is not bad. I like that. I like that. It feels good. It smells good too. It smells really like a really light, pleasant smell. Fresh, clean, fresh, clean smell. Not like linen. Um, it just smells so nice and clean. Like, uh, I don't know how to describe it, but it's really pleasant. Like really, you're like, oh, it smells so good. It doesn't smell like lavenders or anything like that. It doesn't smell like linen. It smells has another type of uh, perfume scent. Let me see what's in the ingredients. Um, 
it says that it's camellia. That's camellia or green tea to fix your caffeine. Let me see if there's what the fragrance is. It just says perfume, but it doesn't say what kind what 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 kind of perfume it is. But it smells good and for now it's not irritating my skin. I don't feel itchy. I just feel clean and smooth and look how it's soaking into my skin the serum my skin is looking a little bit more filtered i should say it doesn't look dry or oily it looks kind of glowy maybe that's why it's called glow lace glam glow glow lace you know what i think i'm gonna get this on the add-on store the pop-up store if they have it for sale yeah for this month in january so yeah, it's 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 already like sinking into my skin. Like it's already like, like it's not even wet at all. Wow. Yeah, I really like this for now. This is my first impressions, but I will come back on to update you on um, how it how it, you know if I had any kind of reaction throughout the day, or if I start to feel itchy or anything. Stay tuned for that update. Well, hello, my gems. Hello, hello. This is an update. It's been an hour already and my skin feels good. Still, it's, I, it's, I still feel like that. I have that. Um, like I have that. Um, what do you want to say? That protection or that hydration feel to my skin. And I even put sunblock on and I didn't have no kind of reaction. To, no kind of reaction. No kind of itchiness or irritation or anything like that to my face even after putting putting the sunblock on so um i don't know i was skeptical about getting this at first because i know boxy charm was sending us you know the 111 skin the 111 skin um masks and um well i got this in my boxy charm and i was like well it doesn't look as intense as the other one does so let me try this you know video first and try it out try this mask out and have you guys enjoy it and and see for yourself how it performed for me it performed very well for me i i really gotta say it even looks like i min it minimized my wrinkles when i go like this it doesn't like it hydrates my skin to the wear and this isn't true lighting this isn't real lighting it kind of hydrated my skin to where it kind of blurred out my wrinkles. And it's giving me a glow. And I never wore Glam Glow products ever in my life. Never have I ever wore Glam Glow, Glam Glow products. For the simple fact that I was skeptical because I had um, another YouTuber say that they had an allergic reaction to Glam Glow. To one of their recovery masks. And I was so scared of like which one it was. I wasn't sure. But I have a line of Glam Glow products that I'm going to start introducing uh, so that my my skincare junkie my skincare junkies would take advantage of of seeing that um, Glam Glow you know products and how they perform on my skin. But they this one performed very well for my skin. Let me know if you got the same effects as I did. Um, I'm very happy with it. I'm very excited and happy about it and for it. So let me know. Leave your comments down below. If you've had any problem with it, if it worked well for you, um, or if it, or if you had a bad reaction to it, then let me know what happened. Yeah, I would like to know everything that you know your you had your experience, you know, on this product as well. So it was a, a double a double mask pack. It was a two pack mask. So stay tuned to see the video using this glam glow eye mask so i may either put it during the evening or i might put it in the morning so what tickles my fancy that's whatever i'll um that's whenever i'll i'll try this mask on so stay tuned for a video using this mask all right my gems so thank you for watching thank you for joining me today um i love you all y'all have a wonderful day as well and I'll see you in my next video. So don't forget to subscribe and follow me on social media. And I have a giveaway going right now. And um, so if y'all have not seen my giveaway preview, sneak peek on it. I'll go ahead and put the video up here. 
so that way you can see um, the video. You'll see the video on the sneak peek of my January giveaway. And it's running, it's going to go all through January, through the end of January. And by February, I'll announce who the winner is of, of that item. And then before I announce the winner, I will also... Um, I will also put a video out showing you the contents inside the box. That way you'll know. I already said what it was. Well, yes, it's a box because it's, it's, it's a box. It is a box. So don't miss out on seeing what's inside that box. It's a mystery box for you guys, but for now. And then you'll be able to see what's inside. And if you're interested in joining in, just leave your comments down below uh, when I do that video. But like I said, follow me now on Instagram and Twitter. And also subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so. That way you'll be entered in my giveaway. All right. I'll see you next time, my gems. And um, until then, take care and have a good day or night.